it's Alyssa. I just arrived in Boston, Massachusetts. Hey! And I have like half a day to check out all the food I want to see. So let's go. I'm at Clover in downtown Boston and this vegetarian based company was founded nine years ago to improve the environment through food. Plus their mission is to turn carnivores into veggie lovers. So this is totally up my alley. Their chickpea fritter sandwich is one of the most popular items on the menu. And I'm gonna taste the chickpea fritter right now. Mmm. Wow. That is good. Oh my god. It is like salty and crispy and crunchy and like packed with herbs and flavors. I gotta know what's in this. It's time to try this sweet potato platter. They have so many cool things. They have sweet potato soda from this surplus of sweet potatoes that they bought. So let's try this sweet potato platter. This is a curried carrot salad, a farro broccoli salad, sweet potatoes. So the sweet potato has some like slaw and then it also has tempura fried sesame seeds. So it's got this crunchy, sweet, savory, and then a shoyu mayo. Wait, this bite is really big, but I'm doing it. Mm. Oh my God. Vegetarian food has never tasted so good. Sweet potato party, sweet potato party. Yeah, so in um, 2014, one of our farmers, Ray, uh, from Next Car and Over, um, had a bumper crop of sweet potatoes, which means like all the stars aligned for there to be a perfect sweet potato crop, and it was um, more prolific than he thought it would be. Um, and he called up Clover and was like, hey, I have all these sweet potatoes, and we're like, oh, we'll buy all of them. It was 9,000 pounds. And now this is the third year we're running the sandwich. We're up to 33,000 pounds from that one farm. 33,000 <laughs> pounds of sweet potatoes from one farm. Next up in Boston, Cocoa Beet. They are 100% plant-based, dairy-free, gluten-free smoothies, juices, totally made from scratch. They make everything here from scratch. All of the nut milks and cheeses, totally organic. Check out this massive, gorgeous kale chip. This is my kale chip dance. I am standing outside of Cocoa Beat, about to try their avo toast. Oh, it's perfection. Woo! Chili flakes. Woo! A little spicy. There's some sunflower seeds for some crunch. Um, the tomato brings a bright freshness. This is divine. Now I'm at a Boston Public Market where they have this gorgeous farmer's market um, as well as uh, a bunch of cool places to eat. This is really cool. I'm going to do some exploring. Have you tried Taza chocolate? I buy these at Whole Foods all the time and had no idea that they were local to Massachusetts. And here's their little shop in the market where they're making their own hot chocolate drinks out of their fresh ground chocolate. Amazing. I did a little quick change and now it's time for dinner at the Little Donkey. Okay, just ordered dessert and we got the cookie dough, which is literally on the uh, beater still. Yum. Yeah. 